Why only nine instead of ten for Virginia? I happen to be there and I got wet. Lucky you. <laughs> Zaglinski on the shot block. He gets it out to Scott who has some range and Scott knocks it down. See what Penn State can do early. Andrew Jones misses on a jump shot. Jackson tried to get the follow and Penn State just keeps at it. Top talent. But after winning the NIT last year, which is a turn of the corner for Ed to tell us and they will knock him down. And that pressure becomes cumulative. Brooks wide open and Brooks knocks down the three. Kept a lot of these guys around after the firing of Dave Latham. Nice drive that time by Battle. He just <laughs> missed. I'm often accused of that. But he did miss. And Scott still perfect. Six. Yeah. And you play good defense and shoot well. A lot of good things happen. Nice dish from Taylor Battle to end. Good defense by Penn State. They come up with a steal. Frazier behind the back. Good pass. Battle got it. Battle. Boy, he's quick. Went right down the lane. Got by the defender that time. Frazier was open. Pass on the shot. They get it to Battle. He will try one from long range and knock it down. Taylor. There's an offensive rebound. Scott finally missed one. Mancy throws it away. Here comes Frazier. Told you this young man has got open floor excitement written all over him. White shirt trying to flatten him out. Battle trying to get inside. Oh, Farrakhan man. did a great job. Stayed right in his face and he made it anyway. God. Has been stone cold here. And Frazier knocks it down at the other end. Boy, that's which is uncharacteristic of Tony Bennett type of offense. Look at that. What a pass by battle. Talk about Michigan State at Carolina, Duke and Wisconsin. And they talk those games, but I think if we take a look at that score right there. Jones from battle, another great play. But Calvin Baker doesn't look like he's quick uh, uh, enough uh. to stay with him. And if you don't stay with him, that's exactly what he's going to do. He's not a great long range. Church stepping up trying to take the ball out of his hands, but when he plays with his team, uses screens. Look at the Nittany Lions run and score. Brooks on the bounce pass gets the bucket, draws the foul. When Taylor Battle uses screens and he can catch and shoot and create quickly, Penn State scoring. Once again, Battle leading the break, surveys the floor, finds the open man. And, and with that kind of Work ethic in the weight room that gives you an awful lot of confidence. And Mike Scott began this game perfectly, and since then has really been carrying his team. And talk Shot about clock and oh. six, and how's that for Harkins? Taylor Battle got 14 in this half, and here he comes again. Now you got to pick him up 27, 28 feet from the hoop, and he gives success inside look at the success drive into the basket but they'll take that battle who's been hot in the second half hot's not the right word scorching marks the offense that's just to get him more involved get some movement battle that's a quick Good. shot Great. but i guess when you make it it doesn't matter how quick it is he's got 23 he's got that smile on his face you'd be smiling too credit to the Penn State coaching staff. Penn State switched to a, a set that allowed him to go kind of north-south. Consistency. Battle of the line hits this one. What's going to be allowed and what's not going to be allowed? Battle with 27 points. In a game like this, Evans is moving his feet so well. We're down to 27-2 now, and Battle, who is taking control of his scoring, now... 28 points, 29. That matches his career high. Zaglinski on target. Holy cow. Ooh. I got a feeling if you look now. Three-point game rattled both of them home. You know, you make sure he has it. Now you foul him right here and make him shoot two shots. They're not going to foul. They're going to let him take the shot. 
Frazier. Zelensky got by battle. Frazier tried to foul him. He tried to foul him, but when he started to raise up in shooting motion, he let him go smartly. Penn State, the first Big Ten team to win three straight in this challenge, but boy, what a watch to see if there is a foul. Oh, I'm sorry, it was it was battle that yeah, tried it was. to foul him, and then he decided not to. Once again, the final score, Penn State 69, Virginia 66. And in the Big Ten ACC Challenge, the Big Ten leads 1-0. Up next on ESPN2, the 2009 World Series of Poker. For Len Elmore and our entire crew, this is Mike Patrick. Thanks for watching. This has been a presentation of ESPN, the worldwide leader in sports. Good night, everybody, from Charlottesville, Virginia.